Today we're going to make our bird seed ornament. So in your project bag that you received, you should have a Christmas themed cookie cutter, a bag of gelatin, a few little cups of bird seed, and some string. So what we're going to first do is ask that you line the cookie sheet or whatever you're using to place your cookie cutters down on as they dry to line it with a parchment paper, wax paper, foil works fine. That's what I'm using today. And just kind of put it down and place it out of the way so that part is ready. Next up, you are going to have to find a bowl that you can put in the microwave and fill it with one cup of water and then microwave that until it is hot. So about one to two minutes. Okay, now that you've got your hot water, you're gonna wanna take your packet of gelatin, shake it a couple of times. Go ahead and open that up and pour it into the water. And then take a spoon or a fork and mix it in until it's completely dissolved. So this could take a few minutes of stirring. Make sure it gets completely dissolved and packed in there. Okay. Then you're going to take your hot water and if you need to ask your parents for help and pour that water gelatin mixture right into your bird seed and make sure that gets fully mixed together. Now we gave you a little bit extra bird seed just in case you need more to fill up so everything gets kind of covered in that water mixture but it's not too soupy in the end. So if you need to add a little extra bird seed until it becomes a good mixture. And if you have more cookie cutters at home, go ahead and fill all the cookie cutters you want to with them. We provided you with one. So after that is all mixed together and incorporated, you're going to get your pan with your foil or your parchment paper or whatever you have ready. Take your cookie cutter, go ahead and just place it down on there. And then you're going to fill the cookie cutter with that gelatin bird seed mixture. Make sure to pack it down as you go so it's nice and tight with no air bubbles. Really fill it as full as you can and pack down tight so it gets that cookie cutter shape. Okay, once you get that all done, take the straw that we provided also for you and you're going to put a hole in the middle and kind of pack around with your fingers. Now you're gonna leave the straw in there as it dries so a hole will dry through it and allow for you to put a string when you hang it on the tree. Now this will take about 12 to 24 hours to dry so make sure that you have a place to put this somewhere that it can be out of the way because you've got more um, projects to do. And then when it's all completely dry, you can pop it out of that cookie shell, put the string through it, and hang it on a tree outside. Thanks!